the Quant Crawler Futures extension is officially in the Google Chrome store. It ended up hitting the store yesterday in the morning. I actually woke up to it, didn't even get an email. I had people telling me it was live, so it was quite the awesome surprise going into Wednesday morning. Let me just quickly walk you through the updates that have happened with Quant Crawler this week because we have the Chrome extension for Futures, which is insanely efficient, and we now have Forex, crypto, and options all automated where you just enter in a ticker and it gives you the output with the expected direction, whether it's bullish or bearish. And I'd love to walk you through if you'll give me the opportunity to watch it to show you what we've done this week. Okay, guys, right here, if you have not seen it, this is quantcrawler.com. I won't walk through this whole thing in case uh, you guys already know what this is, which a lot of you do. You can come here and get a free 30-day trial. After that, it's just $9.99 a month. Um, but essentially, Quant Crawler does AI analytics on any ticker that you put into it. Um, on futures, you upload three charts. On Forex, crypto, and options for stocks, you just simply go in and type in the ticker, and it analyzes the 15-minute, 5-minute, and 1-minute, or 4-hour, 1-hour, 30-minute, and it will give you an output and analyze support resistance and expectations. So, um Anyone can do this right now, quantcrawler.com, 30-day free trial, and then after that, it's just $10 a month. We have a couple promotions going too. You can do a lifetime, you can do a six-month, um, but once you get logged into Quant Crawler, this is what you're going to see when you land here. You have all four tabs right here. I'm going to show you guys first the automation on Forex. You click this, it opens up in a new tab, and you just come down to the search bar, and you type in XAUUSD. That's our most searched. So once you type that in, it runs and it gives you an expected output analysis. So you can see here, it ran for XAU USD, just like we entered in, it says expected direction is a short. It gives you the stop loss, where to set your pips, the target, and it gives you a breakdown of the 15, five and one minute. So same exact thing for options. Uh, this is new to us this week. Um, we just got this added in. And so I'll just type in on a zero day to expiration contract, which would be today analyze the 15 5 and 1 and i'll just put spy in here and uh, wait for its output so based on the 15 5 and 1 it says the trend is ranging and uh, bearish on the one minute is what it's seeing so it would recommend to put its confidence level is 75 percent suggested expiry is zero days to expiration which is today the delta range you want to look at 0.4 to 0.5 that's going to be a little bit high on a zero day to expiration so you're going to have to make some judgment calls there um, then strike selection, use your broker's option chain to find a strike matching the delta range above. And then it gives you the trade rationale right here of why it is seeing that, why it's saying that. And then, of course, the risk notes, like always, options can lose 100% of premium. That's why options are a ton of fun. And then crypto, you just come in here, we'll just do BTC and run for Bitcoin. So you then get your Bitcoin output if you are doing a short or a long, and it gives you your multi time frame analysis. Now, that's for these three right here, options, forex, and crypto. I have not done this for futures yet because futures is our most popular, it's our most used, and I want to verify that these three are working fine and vet out any bugs and issues before I bring it to futures because futures actually drives about 85% of all the analysis that Quant Crawler runs. So I don't want to mess up essentially the money maker, if you will. This is what everybody's using as their money maker in analyzing futures charts. So to streamline that, I built out a Google Chrome extension that you can use that will be helpful. So is what you want to do is come over to the Chrome web store. This is only available on Google Chrome right now. If you use a different browser, I'm sorry, it's only on Chrome at this time. You just want to type in Quant Crawler and it brings up the chart analyzer right here. I already have it installed and it's this QC button right up top. So the next thing you want to do is go into trading view. So I am here on trading view right now and I'm going to go to the 15 minute time frame. Now is there's been a couple of bugs because this just came out today. A lot of users say they can do this. For some reason, I am not able to, but the main function of this is to go do control shift and Q and it will automatically snapshot this right here. Like I said, for me, I seem to be like the only person this doesn't work for, for some reason, but you can see up here, on detected ticker, it's on GC, which is what we're looking at, which is gold. 
we're in scalping and on the 15 minute you can just click capture current chart it then goes captured you don't have to go in order anymore um like we used to have to do on these you can just go then over to the one minute back to qc click capture it populates the one minute for you so you then just need to capture your five and the minute you click this button now, you click the analyze button and it will immediately pull you into quant crawler and you just click, I understand. And it immediately starts running your analysis on a scalp with the 15, five and one, and it gives you your breakout. So short is what it's saying, which you can see here. That's a very, uh, that's a very obvious call. Um, so I'm glad it says short because that's where we'd be price 4213. There is some movement here. It, we must have took a snapshot when it was down here, um, which is why it's pulling that up probably on the one minute. But it's giving your analysis and your output. And then from here, you're into the trade journal and doing all of that. But the quant crawler extension, I am trying to debug why for some reason, me as the developer, I'm the only one who cannot use control shift Q. I don't know why that would be. Um, it's not a setting. There's nothing to adjust. Um, so I got to work on that. Uh, let me know on the feedback if it doesn't work for you. But right now, uh, I'm the only one saying it doesn't work. Everyone else says it's fine. So I guess I'll just suck it up and deal with it. Um, no matter what, all you have to do is just click capture on the 15, five and one, and then click analyze. It will automatically pull you into quant crawler, start the analysis. You're not doing screenshots anymore. And then pasting here and hopping back and forth, getting all your screenshots at one time, clicking analyze straight into quant crawler. So we've made that more efficient and easy to get your results quicker. That was the goal. Um, and then over the next two weeks or so, I'm working on the integration, but I need to make sure, like I said, Forex options and crypto are working fine. And that's kind of the quick update for what we've done this week. And this will be the only update this week. I'm not doing anything else on it. Um, just gonna let it sit through Christmas, simmer, let people get results, let people get wins. Let's talk about the losses and just kind of get used to the platform without any more changes because I've been changing a lot. So that right there is Quant Crawler update for this week, the Chrome extension and the automation. Um, we have a full journal built into this. We have an awesome Discord. Our Discord is coming up on 2,900 members now. Um, and I would appreciate the support. I mean, free 30 days to try it, $10 a month after that. You can get a six month trial for $50 if you want to front load that and pay it up front. You essentially get a month free. It's about the best discount I can do when we're only charging $10 up front anyways after a 30-day trial or a lifetime membership. If you want to do that, it's $349. We've had a ton of people sign up on the lifetimes lately, but there are people who have been using it. They're getting results. They know it works and uh, they want to support the project. So there are three options of what you can do with Quant Crawler um, as far as committing to the project, but start with a 30 day trial and try it out. I know it works. I know that you're going to see that it works and I would love to have your support on the project.